Welcome back to the Performance Video Training Series. In this video, we will cover how to properly firmware update an H Control enabled device using the NetSetter utility within Performance. When opening the software, if your device is connected to the internet, Performance will alert you if new firmware is available for devices. Make sure you are connected to a network with an active internet connection for the download to proceed. After the latest firmware has been downloaded, the progress bar will disappear and a green message will appear at the top of the screen indicating the firmware download has been successful. If devices have been found on the network and the firmware is out of date, performance will display a message. To begin a firmware update on a device, first click on NetSetter. Devices discovered on the network will be listed here. If no devices are discovered, you may need to set the correct network adapter by clicking the network adapter button and adding the adapter your devices are connected to. For a firmware update to work, we need to first ensure the devices show as running in the status column. If they say discovered, ensure the IP address and subnet are in the same range as the device running NetSetter. Every device listed in NetSetter has a firmware column that displays the device's current installed firmware. An orange circle with the download icon inside of it, next to the device's firmware, indicates an update is available. To update a device, click the down arrow next to the firmware version and select the desired version. The firmware box will now be outlined in orange to indicate that a change is pending. Select the device or devices that you are updating with the checkbox on the left and click the firmware update button at the bottom of the screen. A pop-up will warn you to save your venue file and to make sure you do not interrupt the devices while they update. It is important that devices maintain network and power connectivity during this process. Clicking OK will begin the update. The status bar for each device will display the progress of the firmware update. At the end of the transferring stage, all devices that were initiated together will wait for the other devices to finish transferring before triggering the update. After the device has automatically rebooted, the status will return to show running. The firmware update is now complete. 